I've often wondered what separates us from beasts, other beasts, that is. Tools? Yeah. What single factor isolates us so? So, what is using tools? We're only one small fragment of Mother Nature. What has this provided? Is this some sort of a <clears throat> advantage? <clears throat> ah. Or rather a crutch prosthetic for some giant disability? What advantage has there been for us to require tools? Sometimes we use these to get splinters out in the field. Woodworkers. They're such nice people. They even go so far as to say Christ and his father Joseph were cabinet makers. Noblest of tasks, a maker in wood. Well, perhaps. But cabinet makers have traditionally made coffins. The final piece of furniture for the body. The final prosthetic. The drawer for the corpse. These are beautiful things. They've been used to build cities, and houses, furniture, wooden limbs, where war has killed land confiscated, patterns for iron castings, aircraft hangers, runways, even tanks, campaign furniture. Using tools is a beautiful thing. I don't think using tools is so human-centric, uh, but perhaps what it is is that we build tools, and that's very different. Uh, it's a shame, really. Other beasts don't consider their situation so inadequate that they must enhance it, so. cabinet maker gets to know this object like no other. I guess because it resides at the source of his conviction. And I think the hand plane probably more than any other tool more than the saw, or the chisel, or the square, or the drill. where the rubber hits the road. I can field strip, sharpen, tune, and reload one of these babies in under a minute. Perhaps less if I had to.
where the food for his family comes from. This is his weapon of survival. God, I love the smell of cast iron. And the handles of these things are made of rosewood. And if this plane is almost, what, 75 years old, it still smells like roses. Rosewood, interesting wood. I don't know why they chose it. Uh, kind of expensive, but also it doesn't split very easily. It's a sinewy wood, very, very hard. Uh, maybe it's got something to do with England controlling wherever they got the wood from. Look at the beautiful curve of the side of a plane. You know, you need maximum strength here because you've weakened the sole so here with the slot for the blade and then it dissipates as you need less and less structure but resulting in such a lovely undulating form in the Japan black Bailey Stanley bought Bailey This is the soul. When working in such an established profession, one has its history to contend with. We often employ old ways, old tools, <clears throat> old materials, even. And therefore, kind of establish a confluence with the past. Well, a deliciously sensual action. This is also an aggressive act. Some cultures push, some cultures pull. sound when the blade is sharp. It's like a musical instrument, really. Musical instruments. The most precise level of woodworking. Scottish warriors and the advancing horror of the bagpipes. <clears throat> Those were made of ebony, and ivory, I think. The orchestration, the orchestras of the concentration camps, the concealed messages of the Chicago mobsters. Beautiful concealed weapons. God, this is starting to sting again. <clears throat> 